Hey guys, so today I'm going to make a video that's a bit different from the videos I usually make. Recently, a fellow Alicia YouTuber called Goey made a video called Stop Getting Mad at Boost Holders. In this video, she talks about how people in this community feel about quote-unquote boost holders. After seeing the video, I thought I would give some of my opinions on the topic as it's something I seem to talk about frequently with other players. Now, I know this community isn't perfect, and it has major flaws, but so does every other gaming community out there. I don't think I've ever played a game that has a community that is completely made up of nice and friendly people. I don't know if that's just because I'm playing the wrong games or something, but my point stands. That said, one of the things about the AO community that bugs me is that this community tends to complain a lot. And one of the things people tend to complain about is boost holders. The reason why I find this so annoying is that it's hard to believe people actually get mad about this. Boost holding is a legitimate tactic that is part of the game, as the way to do it right is by using a different stat on your horse than what people usually use. It's not cheating in any way, it's just using different stats to your advantage. When I first heard about people using speed horses instead of control horses in Magic, I was actually excited as I find it really interesting that people are finding new ways to play this game. I have been running control horses ever since Magic came out, so it's so cool to see people switching it up. Nowadays, I tend to play speed more than Magic as I've gotten bored of Magic, and learning to play speed has been really fun. One of the things I like about speed is that there are so many different stats that people use. Some use speed stat, some use strength, some use agility, and a lot of people use a combo of these. So it's weird to me to see one side of the community actively being creative with different horse stats to suit their play styles, and then the other side getting mad when people do the exact same thing. The main reason why I see these people get mad is because they lose to these players. I don't see any other legit reason for so many people to be so upset about this. Don't worry guys, there are ways to count these players. It's not like they're unbeatable. A point I've seen from a few people is that being mad at boost holders is very hypocritical, as I'm sure loads of these people tend to hold shields in their races in case they are attacked. Should we call this shield holding? Or what about, let's say, I was trying to counter these boost holders by holding a bolt at the end of the race in case they run in front of me before the finish line. Should I be called a bolt holder? No, that would be ridiculous. Shield holding and bolt holding are just things players do to try to counter other players in order to win. I don't see why boost holding should be any different. I really, really enjoy this game. I've been playing AO for five years for a reason. I've made so many friends on Alicia, including some of my best friends. But I asked this community, please stop attacking people for their playstyle. And please, please keep experimenting with different playstyles because it's one of my favorite things about this game. If you haven't already seen Goey's video, I highly recommend you do. She makes some excellent points, and she inspired me to give my own opinion on this topic. If you don't agree with some of the things I've said, please comment down below. I'm willing to have a debate. Just try to be, just be nice, guys. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I'll see you all later. Bye, guys.